you get that for sure. I mean, it's always good to get a win. Um, yeah, hopefully, it's a turning point and you know, moving in the right direction for us. Hopefully, build some rhythm, some chemistry, some confidence, um, different vibes, atmospheres, so we can you know turn it around. Now the Pelicans on Thursday, your last time you played, you had those guys on the rope. Do you talk about doing anything different? Did y'all watch tape on the last game, or you just moved forward? Oh, of course we did. Um, especially when it's that close, we know what little mistakes we made that we can fix. We just execute down the stretch, and early in the game, you know, we will close a game like that out. Um, obviously, not having the experience we used to have, um, it's a little different now, different look, different team. But you know, we still got to execute. So hopefully, we can. Come out, execute better than we did last time uh, for a longer period of time than them. Patty said he doesn't look at the standings. Are you different in that aspect? Do you pay attention to the standings? No, I'm no different. Okay. Um, but obviously, we notice you know from year to year, it's a big difference when you know you talked about quite frequently you know last year and you know who's the top teams in the league, you know, who has a percentage or who has a chance of doing this or doing that in the playoffs. And you know, this year, we haven't been up there a lot of times. We haven't been talked about, but. Other than that, standings doesn't mean anything, but we still want to be um, one of those teams that you know, has a chance or is a threat or talked about. You know, we know what we could potentially be, but until we do it ourselves on the court, you know, we won't be a threat to anybody. But it starts, you know, night in, night out. Were you aware you guys were 10th coming into tonight? It was just a weird thing <laughs> to see standing. I mean, I didn't look in the standings, but obviously it's circulating and yeah. everybody's <laughs> talking about it. It's hard not to hear it. But um, I said it's not something we're focused on. It's not something we pay attention to. But at the end of the day, we, we know what we're capable of, what our potential is. And you know, we want to be back in the conversation of one of those top teams that I could do something special. What was your approach going back to the starting lineup? Today? I didn't find out until before tip. So you know, it's approach the same as every game. You know, come out and do my job. Um, you know, be a defensive, you know, active player and let the offense come. Uh, first couple. Get some good looks, they didn't fall, but eventually, you know, a lot of us started making some more shots. We got a lot of our open looks fueled from our defense, and that's where it starts for us. Are the looks for you different with the starting group as opposed to the second group, or does it not? Oh, yeah, it depends on who I'm playing with. They're, they're very different. It doesn't matter who's starting. I wouldn't say different from the starting to the second group, but I just think it depends on who's on the floor with me. Um, we got four smalls, obviously, going to be different. When you got two of bigs with Powell in LA, it might be different. Um, it might be different when Tony's in there, it might be different when Manu's in there. Um, but it's all something you have to adjust to in the flow of the game. Regardless, you've got to be a professional, be able to you know, come and knock down shots and do you know, what you do offensively. Defensively, so that's stay consistent. But offensively, uh, be ready to you know, catch and shoot when it comes. And that's for everybody in here. Danny, Danny is, is, is the mindset of the team regarding Kawhi the same as it's been you know, last week? week before? Hasn't changed. Pop said before the game that the, you know, he hasn't even been clear. You know, hasn't, the stuff. Hasn't, hasn't changed. The mindset's still the same. So playing with the group that we have right now, and that's what we're focused on. Are you guys just kind of ready for the Kawhi saga to be over one way or another, so we're not asking you about it every other day? I guess some people are, but we're not really focused on that. You know, we're focused on right now winning games, uh, do what we have to do with the group that we have now. Uh, obviously, that's going to be a topic regardless whether he's playing or he's not playing. You know, he's top three in MVP voting last year, so he's a special player. So regardless if he's playing or not, he's going to be a topic. But so we just control what we can control and focus on what we need to focus on. Thanks, Andy. Thank you. Thank you, Dan.